checking the church was a good idea. Now I know that Alyosha is alive. I still can't call the Aurora. But at least I know they intend to rendezvous with us at the dam. There is some really bad news, though. Anna has gotten worse. I must hurry back to her. That's unfortunate. Anyways... Be a normal field trip with a frizz? No way, uh, cruising on down Main Street. Skin feeling good. Next thing that you know, you're singing. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. No sound waves, singing through the stars. This is good, man. I'm a magic school bus. I'm a magic school bus. To take that. Right on the magic school bus. Lava. Anyways, welcome to some more Metro Exodus. So it looks like we're gonna go meet Alyosha, or how the fuck you say his name, and the Aurora at the dam. Sadly, we did lose our little, our little cart, our little train. So that sucks, but whatever. At least the main train isn't gone. We lost our little thing that we just got in the desert. Our little pull train.
Hey, what's over there? Let's check it out. Hmm, how was your walk? Waste of trip. Oh well, could have been a wolf. I see him! He's here! Strike over dirt! Ooh, this is not going well. Come here. Oh, sleep. 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 Sniper over there on the left. There's also another guy over here. I'm coming for you. Hold on. Stay where you are. 
Ooh, ooh, ooh! Catch these hands! Come here, let me run your fade. Ooh! Sleep, bitch! Get your fade, Ram. Ooh! These guys are bad shots. I mean, they are used. They used to be just kids, but still, they're bad shots. Oh, I see you. Prize. Sleep. There's a boat. <laughs> okay, I hear you. But where are you? Oh, shit. At least they communicate. Good call outs. Where'd you go? Oh, hey, there you are. Hello, fella. These are not very good guards. I've just been waltzing through all of you. <laughs> this is also a normal mode, by the way. That I'm just like blitzing through these guys. Oh, wait, gate. Postcards? Nope. Okay. Here we go. Open sesame. too easy. Get out of here. Take it to the dam, okay. Off to my right. Is there gonna be more enemies? That seemed a little easy. That's fucking spooky. Hold on. Alright, let's go.
Oh. Knew it couldn't be that easy. Uh, okay. Are we sure this mill's abandoned? <laughs> because there's, uh, what's his face? The, uh... The, uh, the, uh, Admiral... The Admiral... Uh, oh shit! <laughs> Admiral is supposed to be here somewhere. Is it just you? I got corpses. Holy shit. Plenty of corpses, actually. Nope, can use to get up there. Okay. Oh, can I? Alright, guess we're going this way. I have a feeling we're not gonna encounter too many friendlies in here. Locked door. Another corpse. Dead body again. Looks like the guys that stayed here didn't do too hot. Looks like a generator.
No way this way. Let's go this way then, I guess. The hell's all that noise? Admiral's still here. Oh shit! Oh, generator. Let me guess. No gas? Oh, there's gas. Burn. Oh shit! Pendeja. I think the poor guy's going crazy. Fella? Are you gonna be nice? have that book. Metro twenty thirty four, Metro twenty thirty three. I have all the I have all the Metro books actually. Brad got your tongue. So you can't knock on the door anymore, eh? As the teacher said, courtesy distinguishes us from bandits and other animals. Wait a moment. You're not one of ours. A bandit then. Not the black one. Though you never know what they're bandits. Different shit every day. Am I right or what, Senya? Oh, God. You're always right, Admiral, sir. Uh, put a sock in it. Your nose is brown enough. Where was I? Ah, the bandit. Well, you're here. Which means that all those spineless worms and wannabe pirates are all dead. Am I right? Don't bother answering. Everyone knows I'm right. And good riddance, I say. Perhaps we should offer him our hospitality, Admiral, sir. He is a guest, even though he's a bandit. Ah, that's an idea. Take a seat, bandit. Let's have some tea. I bet you never tried anything quite like it. I gathered, dried, and brewed it myself. Can't get any help from this worthless lot. At least, they don't eat much. Hey, boys! Yeah! Trying our best, Admiral, sir! Ah, uh, quit your yapping. Making a worse racket than the damn aquas in heat. No respect for our guest, either. He can't get a word in edgewise. Oh, he's that. gone crazy. To our meeting. I don't think this is gonna be good. good tea. The fussy ground-loving rats don't drink it, though. 
Radiation! Radiation! Radiation, my ass! Radiation. Just look at us! Dangerous. We're all healthy as can be! <laughs> Thanks for coming here. See how happy my boys are? We don't really have anyone to talk to here anymore. They all left We're the all coward. forgotten here. Even Roman forgot about us. Yet he was here with us when we built this base. All the boys remember that. Don't you now? Yes, he was here. Poor guy. I remember. We all remember. That's right, boys. You all remember. But that bastard just forgot. And the other ground-loving rats, too. They all forgot. We're protecting them all with our lives here. At first, they were so happy. They shouted, We'll kill all the bandits! The pioneers are cowards! The teacher is wrong! We're better off attacking! Didn't they, boys? Yeah, they did! They shouted their throats sore! Yeah, louder than those bandits we shot. There you have it. My boys do remember. And those don't. You could always count on them when you wanted someone to shout and call pioneers names. Aye, but when the going got tough and the Aquas started attacking in their hundreds, they changed their tune. Oh, radiation. Oh, it's dangerous. Oh, the girls say teacher told them to tell us that we have to get out. Well, fighting the Aquas ain't as fun as hanging bandits from the posts. You can rob the bandits when you kill them. But mutants don't have much worth taking. So who cares if they're about to eat the whole valley, right? Pathetic rats. That's who they are. Ground-loving rats! A bit late to start listening to the teacher, too. Though, no, those rats don't care whom they listen to. Be it teacher, or the girls. If doing so gives them an excuse for chickening out. So, they all left. Cowards. <laughs> this poor guy. Even the pioneers have more spine than that slime. They followed Ludmila to the dam. They were going to take the tunnels and then go along the reservoir, those adventurers. I've no idea if they actually got anywhere. But they weren't afraid of no radiation, that's for certain. Well, the only person who still has balls in that sorry lot is Olga. She did visit us a lot here, and she always thrashed those cowards at council sessions. Visit us, my ass! It's you who she visit! Yeah, right. Me! Though, no. if not for my spine, Olga and I would have turned this valley upside down. But now, who needs a cripple? <laughs> to hell with her! A woman on a ship is bad luck. Besides, we stayed with you. Yes, my boys did stay here. I had to do some persuading to make them stay, though. Even you were going to abandon your old friend, weren't you? Weren't you? Come on, Admiral, sir. We'd never do that. Yeah, yeah. Tell that to this new guy. He seems to be all ears. But I can read you all like a book. And I say, you are going to leave me. And had I not brewed my tea extra super strong that day, 
You would have. No doubt about that. Hey, careful with the guitar! Got it, sir. I'll be careful. Come on, remember. This thing is an instrument. Yes, sir. An instrument. What the hell is up with you today? Do you want to scrub the deck so bad? Sorry, Admiral. Don't be sorry. Be better. How about you play something instead of dropping that guitar? I'd go for a shanty. Yes, Admiral. One shanty to coming hell up. Her. To hell, you're all brown loving rats. Rats. <laughs> I've been thinking. Why don't we have a smoke? I say we should. Oh, this is good. Strong, the way I like it. This tea is as good for smoking as it is for brewing. It can also cure any sickness. And solve your marital problems. <laughs> the smell 